He's a real hater, that one. He's a real hater. But now I'm not cool anymore. Damn. Well, you know, can't be perfect all the time. <laughs> Hey guys, so this is going to be a fun episode. <laughs> this is the episode where I read mean comments about myself. I don't know why, but someone thought it would be a good idea. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, Marion, what's with those thick glasses frames? Well, I don't know, like you would think that because I've chosen them that I might like them. <laughs> That's what's with them. Oh goodness, it's so funny. These glasses are quite controversial, aren't they? Well, I like them, everyone. They're my glasses. You should wear different glasses if you don't like these glasses. Or watch someone on a channel who doesn't wear glasses, even better. <laughs> there are plenty of people that don't wear glasses. Marion, it's not pronounced schnitzel. Schnitzel, schnitzel. It's schnitzel with an esh, with a sh, like in sherry. What do I say? I'm sh do I, do I say schnitzel? Who says schnitzel? Probably the actual Austrians. <laughs> hey, in Australian, it's schnitzel. That's right, isn't it, Dax? Australians say schnitzel? Absolutely. Schnitzel. Schnitzel. Oh, although if you were going to say schnitty, schnitty, you schnitty. would say schnitty, but then I would say schnitzel, but then schnitty. Schnitty. Interesting. Interesting piece of Australian <laughs> slang there for you all. <laughs> well, you know. Can't be perfect all the time. <laughs> Sorry, hun, ditch the glasses. They would look better on a guy. Shame on your optometrist. And I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Obviously this person is an optometrist and wants me to know that. So point taken. Good. Marion, your, <laughs> your outfit looks like a dumpling. <laughs> How does my outfit look like a dumpling? Like hmm. seriously, which outfit was that? <laughs> Although I wouldn't mind like a dumpling shaped outfit. Could be cute. Maybe I could do a recipe dressed as a dumpling one day. Gyoza, what kind of dumpling would I be? What kind of dumpling would you be? I would be a gyoza, I think. Oh, maybe Xiaolongbao. Soup dumpling? Soup dumpling, you could have like a poof like here and then like just a big, <laughs> thing <laughs> anyway we'll move on <laughs> marion will you stop putting a metal spoon into a non-stick rice cooker pot okay i can do that easy <laughs> marion you're thai so why do you keep making vietnamese dishes you're doing it all wrong vietnamese people do not cook with brown sugar at all okay well i'm sorry i've offended the whole of vietnam <laughs> I hope that there's no Vietnamese people out there cooking Thai dishes though. <laughs> Cause that would be wrong. <laughs> I mean, I love Vietnamese dishes. I love Vietnam. I love traveling in Vietnam. I'm sorry, I'm not gonna stop cooking Vietnamese dishes because they are delicious. But you can tell me when they're wrong in the comments. I don't mind. Marion, curry is not for me. Well, not for my digestion. <laughs> I'm very sorry, but I didn't enjoy this episode. Oh, that's okay. Poor you. No problem at all. You don't have to enjoy every episode. I don't mind. Marion, I don't know if I'd call kimchi a condiment. It's a side dish. I mean, you know, I, I totally just, kimchi is like a food group. And do you know what I had for breakfast this morning? No joke, like a toasted cheese, ham and kimchi sandwich. Like kimchi belongs everywhere. You know, ragging on me is one thing, but like, don't, you know, don't diss kimchi. Don't diss kimchi on my watch. That's right. Yeah, I'm here for you, kimchi. Marion, no miso? Thank God. You know, I think God is probably very happy with his creation of miso. Ha -ha! Personally, I would prefer not to hear people with their mouth full. I find ASMR very irritating. <laughs> there we go, ASMR. Well, sorry. I like to talk with my mouth full. But you can spoon, mm. not just thick. That's really good. Mm. I'm like, you know, to live dangerously. Marion, okay, you are too big. What? Time to block, thank you very much. I'm too big, as in what? size, wise? Or too big, like, too big for my boots? Am I too big for my boots, Dax? I think she means you've gone mainstream. Oh, right, okay. You're not punk rock anymore. Oh, I'm not punk rock anymore. <laughs> 
<laughs> was I ever punk rock? Did I used to be edgy or something? Did I used to be you cool? Used to be cool I used to be cool. You sold out. Oh, damn it. Oh, I always wanted to be cool. And then I was cool and I didn't even know it. <laughs> now I'm not cool anymore. Damn. Marion, can't you just stop talking and talking and talking? <laughs> just cook. The most annoying video I've seen in a long time. I find this woman really, really irritating. <laughs> So much unnecessary, nonsensical talking about nothing, going backwards and forwards, just frigging cook and keep it simple. Well, that was a very long-winded way to say that. You maybe you could cut down on your own nonsensical words. <laughs> or better yet, maybe watch like an ASMR video where there's no talking. <laughs> oh, that's very funny. Bless. Marion. I hate it all. <laughs> all parts of cooking or creating and generally eating the food. Hate. Is this person even alive? Like, how do they not eat any food? Okay. <laughs> Maybe don't watch a cooking channel. <laughs> sure, there are plenty of like gaming channels you can watch, buddy. Okay, cool. Well, that, I quite like that guy that hates everything, including food. Exclamation mark hate. <laughs> I think he hates hate. He's a real hater, that one. Okay, so to all the haters out there, please click the subscribe button and that little bell notification so you get to know every time I'm releasing a video that will annoy the crap out of you. <laughs>